So tonight I have the honor of recognizing this fine team that helped our juvenile court um, through the Marietta uh, Justice, I'm sorry, the Marietta facility for the Georgia DJJ Central Office Executives. Um, we have some executives with us tonight. Yes, ma'am, they're right back there. Okay, would y'all like to come up as well? Commissioner Oliver, Mark Mitchell, Sean Hamilton, Pamela Johnson Hill, and Glenn Allen. Thank you for being here, sir. So, um, Adolphus asked me if we could do this at um, our Board of Commissioners meeting to recognize the assistance that these gentlemen gave um, our juvenile court during the pandemic and I'm going to turn it over to him to give the details um, but we are honored to have you all here Commissioner we're honored to have you with us all of you and appreciate all you do for us absolutely thank you Commissioner and we just at the juvenile court wanted to say thank you to this team from the Marietta RYDC who often work without recognition and run the facility located in Marietta where all juveniles in Cobb County are detained when arrested and detained by law enforcement. And at the beginning of the pandemic, they were extremely flexible with us and worked with us through the challenges to provide virtual access to court hearings so that there was no interruption in court hearings and also so that the children and the families remain safe through the pandemic. So they continue to this day to work with us as we're running close to 80 court hearings per week at the juvenile court and they provide access sometimes at a moment's notice of being able to make children available so that we don't have to put our sheriff's deputies in jeopardy by providing transportation and again, making those children accessible via virtual platforms. So we just wanted to thank them and thank you, Commissioner Barrow, for uh, assisting us and providing them a little bit of recognition tonight. Judge Brandish, would you have any words? Uh, well, I, I can not echo as well as uh, Adolphus, but the, uh, the work that uh, these gentlemen and, and all of the Department of Juvenile Justice has, has done to facilitate our hearings has been just incredible. Um, they have, as Adolphus indicated, um, been available at a moment's notice, and we're just really proud to have the opportunity to uh, recognize their accomplishments. And uh, thank you, Commissioner Burrell, for helping that, with that process. Would you like to say a few words? Thank you on behalf of Mayor RYDC and uh, the Department of Juvenile Justice. We wanna thank you for acknowledging this team. Um, as our commissioner has always said, our job is to serve and help our juveniles be reformed and rehabilitated so they can return back to the community. And it's our job and we appreciate this opportunity. <laughs> Trying not to get the mic, but um, thank you. Thank you for the recognition. I, it's all about this team right here. We have um, Director Denson and his teams have a um, you know, tremendous team over there. And it's all about them tonight, and that's one of us. Thank you for the proclamation, um, Commissioner, and, and thank you for the partnership with the Juvenile Court, Judge Gratis, because it really takes a village to help these young people um, so they can return to the society um, being more productive and better and a better person. So um, kudos to the team and, and to the whole um, Marriott RYDC. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you. So um, first we have Clement Parker, Juvenile Correction Officer 2. The, the Cobb County Juvenile Court has worked with the Marietta Regional Youth Detention Center to establish a system of conducting remote virtual court hearings. The volume of virtual court hearings conducted by Cobb Juvenile Court since March 2020 has far exceeded that of other jurisdictions across the state. The court's ability to conduct detention-based cases is largely in part due to the efforts of the Marietta RYDC staff. They consistently displayed commitment to professionalism, consistency, and flexibility to provide timely virtual court access for detained children and their families. During this pandemic, they have worked tirelessly behind the scenes as unsung heroes. We thank them for all they do. This is the 15th day of December, 2020, Cobb Board of Commissioners. So congratulations. Thank you for all you do for us. 
So I'm just going to give the other ones, because your thanks says the same thing. Um, <laughs> how about Marietta RYDC Facility Director, Daryl Dixon? That would be you. And Officer Edwin Correa. And last but not least, our RYDC Assistant Director of Security, Willie Hunt. Thank you. A lot of times um, we like to recognize the unsung heroes, as the certificate says. Um, and when Adolphus brought this forward, um, I couldn't think of a more fitting group that really went above and beyond. So thank you for all you do, for our county, for our youth, and God bless you. Merry Christmas. <laughs>